Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the realest nigga alive. Listen up, man. We we got some new NBA 2K21 crucial news when it comes to building your builds, gameplay, the whole shot stick system. I I, I got a lot to talk about. I need y'all to unify, man. We need to unify and come together on Twitter. I need y'all to support me. So make sure y'all listen to this full video, man. We gonna go in depth. We gonna go in depth about young Mike Wayne. Michael Wayne, man. I, I got I got a lot to say. So make sure y'all watch this full video, man. Before we get into everything, make sure y'all subscribe if you new. 300k on the way. Oh, what the? Hold on. <laughs> 300k on the way help a young nigga grow subscribe hit that like button if you like dribbling i, I would love to see how y'all feel about the dribbling system and also after you watch this vid i dropped a build video um earlier today it's a very toxic 2v2 build make sure y'all check it out it's 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 a it's a it's a two-way shot creating sharp shooting playmaker yeah it's pretty crazy man <laughs> But anywho, let's get into this, man. So, young Michael Wayne finally tweets out after we've been begging him for a week. You know, don't y'all think this is crazy? You know, people already posting videos. I'm sure there's a lot of casuals that just catch a vid and be like, oh, I'm gonna make this. They stop looking on YouTube. They don't get updated anymore. Bam, they wasted money. You feel me? But yeah, so Michael Wayne finally tweets out, dribble tier speed boosting thresholds, in quotations, and dunk rating requirements for dunk packages and contact dunks are basically the same in 21 as they were in 20. How hard was that to say? I mean, do you not know? Oh, hold on. Let me let me let me find my comment. Let me find my comment. There it goes. There it goes the swan. Make sure y'all be supporting me on Twitter when I be tweeting at these devs, man. I'm told I'm telling you, I am the woken one. So look, I say bet basically. Is there a requirement for the crazy behind the back or is that just an animation based because in the demo some behind the backs are different very important for build making now if you guys don't know what I'm talking about um when you do the behind the back in the 2KU with Paul George Kawhi Pat Beverly it's vastly different from when you do it with um, a 30 badge playmaking player even though they give you random six or Magic Johnson with Magic Johnson, you are a god. Like the behind the back is like, I love it. I love it. Anything that has to do with speed, I love it. You know, it, it, it separates the casuals. I know a lot of y'all complain about it. I don't care. But anywho, this is very important to know because if they even keep this in the game, I don't know why they would take it out this year and then take it out for next year or put it back in for next year. Like what if they... What if all of us are saying, hey, make this build like this because the behind the back is going to be crazy and then they take it out and then everyone's just, you just get jutsu the whole community, people wasting their money. It's, it's crazy, bro. But I don't know. They added it back. But like, for instance, when you look at Magic Johnson, he's not faster than LeBron, correct? And the ball handle should both be 99, correct? So when I use LeBron on the Lakers in the little quick game stuff, I can't do the behind the back that Magic can do. So I'm wondering if it's a rating or if it's an animation. You know, I, I don't know why Magic Johnson has this crazy animation, but it, it just doesn't make sense to me why LeBron wouldn't be able to do it. But Magic, I mean, I just want I just want a confirmation. Maybe it probably is just animation based, but I would like to know him. There's. There's several different behind the backs. I don't know if it has to do with ratings or animations or, or what. And in 20, it, it was just the rating, right? So I'm like confused. I don't think a lot of people are picking up on this, but uh, yeah, it is very important. So make sure y'all go tweet at Baluba and let them know that, bro. Like I know I said it kind of uh messed up, but you, you get what I'm saying, my boy. Then, then young, young Michael Wang tweeted out, do you want to be able to see your opponent's green lights online? Now look, of course it's a yes, this is obvious, right? I'm a, yes, look at that, 72,000, it's common sense. It's like, okay, cool, like I, I, I fuck with, I fuck with 
making the damn polls asking the community but come on we asking you better shit like this is common sense like as a dev you should know this we've been begging for this for years you know the only thing i don't like about this is because me personally i scream white when um when i shoot a white so my team knows to get the board to crash that i might miss like that's what i do it's just like a natural thing but with everyone being able to see there's no point so i don't scream white no more but um i don't really care i think it's still better to see it so i can call 2k out and they bullshit you know what i mean <laughs> Y'all let me know um, how y'all feel about this, but let's go to my tweet, right? I say, give us unlimited stamina and park. It's a game to 21, right? And then I say, how don't you know people would want this? And I'm referring to this. I'm not referring to my first sentence. I should have wrote it better, but um, this got a big response, my boy. But um, basically what I'm saying is, give us unlimited stamina in the park. It's a game to 21. I'm saying this because we are using gods with 99 speed, 99 stamina. They can go all out in a game to 21. No, no NBA player, no God, no athletic freak is, is moving around every possession like he has asthma. If he does three or four moves, it doesn't work like that in a video game. It's supposed to be exaggerated real life. We are getting we are getting a taste of real life. We are getting limited real life. That's broken, my boy. I don't care what y'all say. Y'all are casuals and you suck. And then people try and say like I'm crazy. I'm just some crazy dri I'm not even a dribble head, bro. I'm just an ISO god, my boy. People saying stuff like I'm crazy. Do you guys know? that unlimited stamina was in every fucking 2k until 17 and those 2k's played better 16 15 14 and back then they played better it's not just oh dribble out the sh bro anyone can dribble out the shot clock you dumb motherfuckers anyone can dribble out the shot clock any year every year do, do you guys not understand that? People are learning to dribble with moves that don't require stamina, right? The spinning hip on top style. Dribble gods don't even know that they actually want unlimited stamina. Imagine if dribble gods, the dribble god movement, if they made all those require stamina, they would be on my side. But no, they, they, they don't get that. And then if they take that out, you done you crying my boy uh, that, that's all i'm saying man all i'm saying is overall when the game increased the speed the speed gap it makes it harder for average casual bum players or people that aren't, don't have the same stick skill to guard someone okay y'all are saying oh this is it's so crazy about in 16 there was a gap you know no my team guy could come get on a pure lock and stick me there's no chance bro i'm moving at a too high speed you guys don't probably don't understand what i mean i'm just telling you like in 15 16 and so on 14 one player if he's better than everyone on the court can win the whole game that's how i believe 2k should be for for a fun gap and and, and etc and a skill gap now it's all these strategics and strats and trying to have op builds and tactics and cheese and exploits instead of someone just having stick skill and destroying you but let's see what else i said man y'all let me know how y'all feel about what i'm saying y'all probably there's probably a lot of y'all on youtube y'all probably just losing your mind i'm just telling you man this is how it should be the the game would play better 2ks are worse now because there's no stamina right it, it applies to defense it applies to every aspect of the game off ball movement isn't here anymore so it doesn't matter it's not hard but anywho i said best two k's had unlimited stamina this community weird lame and ran by casuals that don't want fun y'all want to restrict better players so bad okay y'all let me know how you feel about that if you think my points are valid or not but anywho let's get in to the other things Mike Wang said. <laughs> Listen to this. 
Young Michael says, didn't want to confuse people, but since some asked, you can still shoot bank shots by swinging the right stick up after starting a shot. No one asked this. Look, listen to that. Swinging the right stick up after starting a shot. Doesn't that just like mind fuck you? It's kind of tough, but you can aim north on the stick instead of south if you want. Wouldn't recommend unless you want to show off. <laughs> no one asked for this. What, what is you doing, Michael? Listen to this. GP the teacher says, can you please tell us whether or not we can adjust the sensitivity of the right thumbstick? When we are trying to adjust the aim, it's very sensitive and very tough for big men who use the right thumbstick. We are looking into it. There probably won't be a setting, but we can adjust the sensitivity to make it less jumpy. It'll already be easier in the real game because the meter will be slightly larger. And y'all already know this whole meter was broken. I don't know if y'all seen the clips on YouTube or Twitter, but you can green full court shots over and over again with the, the timing meter. And I knew this was gonna happen. I called it out weeks ago when, when, when it got introduced, man. Crazy. But let's look into what I say. Laughing my fucking ass off. We want 16 dribbling back, my boy. You know, you know, y'all yeah, gotta follow me on Twitter. You know, give me some of your part. You know, you know, give me some of your part. It, link in description. This is not my Twitter. <laughs> some more news of Mike Wayne talking about the goddamn shot stick. Shooting tip for jumpers. Hold the right stick down to start a shot. While still holding, adjust the aim by moving the right stick slightly left or right till the tick is centered in the meter. You can also tap L2 or R2 to lock the aim and time the shot for an additional boost. Basically what he's saying is if you master this, which shouldn't be too hard, you spend a day shooting it, you have a high rated player or something or you're a post scorer you could break the game just like people shooting full court shots i hear there's not even a timing like he says there's like not a timing but i guess if you do time it it's a boost but you're already getting a bigger boost than no i don't know i, I don't like it yeah they all the devs are trying to say it's a skill gap or something and i don't know i just think this is a way to make shooting easier um so I don't like that. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. Look at this. Hold on. This quality. Gross. Look at this. Green. Mike Wayne going to say it's a bug that didn't make it into the game. That That is cap. He, he tweeted about this. It's a bug that didn't make it into the game. Look at this. Look at this. He. He. Niggas is cheating, look. Hey. And he's doing this back to back. Four. Look. Hey. Like, it's no cuts in the video. I'm just skipping. What is this, like six times? Come on, bro. Like, why is this in the game? Look at this. Was this like seven, eight times? Hey! <laughs> like, come on, bruh. Wait, did he do it? He did it again, like 10 times? Come on, bruh. Get this shit out the game. Can you guys make the shot meter bigger? It's really small. I made it bigger in the final version. I, 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 I fucks with it, bro. I was complaining and people saying like, Wait, you complaining about a shot meter? I'm like, bro, it's so small I can't even see the line. Hip hip post notifications if you can't see the damn line in the shot meters. It's it's too small. What's the point? Like I can't even see it. See look, this guy's confused, so help me understand this. Why we have to move the right stick, man, I'm not even reading this. Y'all can go to Mike Wang's Twitter, bro. All he's doing is talking about the goddamn shot stick look at his replies and he's trying to say this is how you do the meter it looks stupid bro 
So like he's saying, don't rush locking it in to get the timing boost. So you actually get a double boost, bro. Like, and then with no shot meter, it's only one boost. I don't know. Like, I don't know, bro. You see, he said it's a bug that was fixed a while ago. The full court green. Uh, also, the jump shot creator isn't isn't going to be a workout. You get it off rip, so that's a W. Anywho. Anywho, that's all the news, man. Y'all go watch my build videos. I posted three so far. They're very clutch, man. Make sure y'all subscribe if you new, man. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I'm not even doing that. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, hold on. Oh, 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 oh. 4,000 likes for a dribble tutorial. Hold on, hold on. I'm not even doing nothing. But um look at me bricking. <laughs> but uh yeah man, go uh watch my other videos. Make sure you subscribe, like the video, comment how y'all feel about all this, man. And I'm out this home, my boy.